WMRN is coming to you live from Michigan International Speedway for today's Sirius Satellite Radio 400. Michigan is known for some great racing and some fantastic finishes. Barney, what are your thoughts on this track? Well, look for speeds approaching 200 miles an hour and cars running three and four wide. That's a recipe for some exciting stuff. Todd Bodine had a great run in qualifying this week. Yeah, this should give that whole team a little boost. They've been struggling in qualifying week after week, but it looks like they're trying to turn things around. I'm proud of these guys. Robbie Gordon really needs a good finish in this race. He's got a long way to go on the points list. And how frustrating that must be. You're working just as hard as everyone else, yet you just can't seem to finish well on race days to gain the valuable points you need. These guys need a good finish just to regain their confidence as a team. Ward Burton would like to break this run of bad luck he's been having at the Speedways. Yeah, I really feel bad for those guys this season. They come to these tracks and work so hard, but they just never seem to get the car exactly right. Racing Dodge. The six row has the Mark Martin Ford and the low Chevrolet. In row seven are the 23 car and the 16 car. Starting the race from row eight are the UPS Ford and the Cheerios Dodge. And in row nine are the Tide Ford and the Target Dodge. Starting in row 10 will be the Dodge Dinger's UAW Dodge and the McDonald's car. In row 11 are the Interstate Batteries Pontiac and the M&M's Pontiac. In row 12 are the Singular Wireless Chevrolet and the Dale Jr. Chevrolet. Ryan Newman, the NASCAR Western Cup points leader, will begin the race from the middle of the field. In row 14, we have the Rubbermaid Ford and the Home Depot Pontiac. Starting from row 15 will be the Kodak Chevrolet and the Square D Chevrolet. In the 16th row are the America Online Chevrolet and the Caterpillar Dodge. In the 17th row are the GM Goodrich Service Plus Chevrolet and the Dodge Dealers UAW Dodge. In the 18th row are the 5 car and the Haviland Ford. Starting the race from row 19 are the Team Rusty Ford and the 37 car. The 20th row has the BAM Racing Dodge and the Sirius Satellite Radio Dodge. Starting the race from row 21 will be the Sprint Dodge and the Motorcraft Ford. And finally, starting from the rear of the field will be the 46 car. Um, I completely forgot about, uh, I forgot to uh, turn on my microphone. So, uh, yeah, uh, that part I just... Whatever. Okay, so yeah, race 1536 at Michigan. I qualified 20th. Um, yeah, Gordon qualified on pole. 
Yeah, I completely forgot to turn on the microphone, so yeah, it was a uh, that was fun. Meanwhile, I'm dropping like a rock for some reason. God, I I hate Michigan so much. I hated NASCAR 06. I hated in 2003. Kenseth, give me room, please, or, or you could just cut me off, that's fine. Okay, now let me just go underneath you guys, three wide, there we go, gonna get by you, Junior, get by you, Johnson, how was Shane Hall in the top 15? Didn't Shane Hall qualify like fourth? He qualified fourth. It is now like in 14th in two laps. That's incredible. Andretti! Thank you. Wait, I, I think you're... Yeah, you're under. I was thinking of uh, Fid Fidipali. Okay, so move up to the 13th spot. We got Jarrett in 12th. Then we got Craven and Nadu there. And McMurray. How are... I don't get it. How is McMurray in the top 15 and Scott Wimmer? What the hell? You guys should be in the back. Lot 4 not complete. We moved up to the 8th spot. Gonna get by Ricky Craven for the 7th position. I think the reason why I qualified 19th was because during qualifying, I kept on turning left too hard that I would go in the apron. And that would just mess up my entire lap. Alright, Mark. Mark! I don't want to mess with you because I just don't. But can you... Yeah. Like, just let me go by. Like, how... Waltrip, he is 6th. Todd but I, I'm not really surprised. You guys qualify all right. And now we're going after the Jeffs. Jeff Burton and Gordon, second and first. Okay, that was bad. That was bad. I hit the apron. I'm catching up the jet to Burton. I'm just five tenths of a second behind him. Jeez, that was a great turn. Gonna get gonna blow right by Jeff Burton for second. Here we go. Yeah, I I I, I, uh, I changed my mind about this track. I actually like Michigan in 2003. I hate it in 06. Yeah, I, I still I still agree on that. Come on, get the lead, get the lead. All right, Gordon leads his lap. We're gonna go on. ah, some in my nose. All right, there we go. We're good. Alright, come on. I wish you could bump draft in this game. You can't bump draft. Shit. Alright, let's just get underneath you, Gordon. Or we could just drive into you. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, it's completely fine, Carl. Let's just not turn. Yeah. Like, the one thing that we have to do in order to not wreck anybody. Yeah, let's not do that. Alright, now we're going to get by him. Really? Oh crap. Crap. I feel like we sh we're gonna pit next time by. We're gonna pit at around lap 10. Still 
Side by side for the lead. Gordon underneath me. Going to get the run off the high lane to get by him. There's drivers on pit road. So I lead my first lap. There we go. Actually, I want to come on pit road when Jeff comes on pit road. Jesus Christ, car, turn! Jeff. Oh, all right. Caution. Okay, Jeff. Now I'm gonna have to take the lead right back. Are you coming on pit road, Jeff? What are you doing? I don't know. Is he is he allowed to come on pit road? Okay. Oh, all right. What happened? What happened? Halfway in this race, caution is out. What happened? Did, did you just say checkered flag? Did you just hear my spotters to check if like Oh Jesus Alright Jeff who's that is that Jeff Green? Alright, just get pile dragged by Kyle Petty. I don't think Jeff Green liked that. And oh Robinson T Bones Petty. Yes, we're gonna have to pit. Four tires as usual. Alright, come on guys, please don't make a mistake. Please don't. You have a shot at winning. Who is that guy in that uh, blue hat? Why is he just sitting there trying to act all cool? Alright, so we come out second behind Gordon. We'll take it, so I think... I know some drivers stayed out on pit road. Actually, I don't know if they're just on lead lap. Okay, no they're not. Alright, here we go. Green flag, eight laps to go in the sat Sirius Satellite Radio 400. Gonna get by Gordon side by side. Jeff Green, please hold him up. Thank you. Thank you, Jeff, for holding up Jeff. I appreciate it, Jeff. Alright, Todd. Oh, okay, Jeff. Jeez. I didn't think you'd get that big of a run. And get underneath Bodine for seconds. Go after Jeff for the lead. Shauna! Please! Shauna! Shauna! Why? Oh! Oh! Okay. My bad, Todd. I wasn't trying to hit you. By top for a second, I'm gonna gotta go after Jeff. Wait, what? Now what? I swear to God, this better not be the race. Yo, look at this run! Woo! 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 I think I got that. I'm not sure what happened. Mike Skinner got he spun out by his. Okay, he got spun out and then gets. He <laughs> gets killed by Kevin Harvick. Spins himself out. Yep. Jesus Christ. Really? You... <laughs> People have a Harvick. He had nowhere to go. Uh, wait, what? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. You're just... Ooh. 
Let's. How? I was in first. I was in first. How? How are you going to? How are you going to? T guys, I was in first. How are you gonna? I didn't come up pit road. I didn't do anything. What is that? No. That is such bullshit. No, the. What the? I am no. Wait, what? Dro what happened to Gordon? Gordon just blew an engine. What the hell is going on? Guys, I am so confused right now. First of all, I was in the lead when the caution came out. Second of all, how did go. Okay then. I'm faster than all these cars, so that's good. I'm gonna pick up some positions. What the hell? Guys, I'm in shock right now. I was in first when the caution came out. I didn't come up pit road. I didn't do anything, and I end up thir 31st. 30 31st. 31st. First. I assure you, all those guys who finished in the back would like to have seen more cautions. Give them a chance to make adjustments without the penalty. What do you mean, finish in the back? I was in front. You have that luxury this time. The McDonald's car oh finished towards the back of the field in this one. Well, he gave it all he had, and that's all you can ask of any driver. You mean I get got I Barney Hall? I love you, but gave it all I had. I was screwed by AI. I was screwed by the game. All right. This 15-year-old piece of technology just screwed me over. Great. Fantastic. fan freaking tastic Newman wins. 30... I don't even... I don't... No, I don't really care anymore. Oh my god, no. That is such bullshit. There's no other way to describe it. I got... I got screwed. So now, because of that, I go from... I move one position down again. Gordon was lead. I don't know what the hell happened with him. Newman is a points leader, 34 points ahead of Rusty Wallace. Johnson third, 62 points behind. Mark Martin fourth. Tony Stewart fifth. Ricky Rudd sixth. Jeff Gordon seventh. Sterling Martin eighth. Kevin Harvick ninth, and Dale Jarrett in tenth. Here's Ray Bastos, Rookie of the Year. Gordon won the poll, and Lyle Mosavsky takes home 15k. Casey Atwood moved up the most positions, takes home 3k. I set the fastest up of the race, take home. I take home 5k. Newman, best finishing rookie, takes home 2k, and Walter made the most exciting pass, takes home 3k. Uh, everything remains the same as the uh, manufacturer points. Chevy still had a Ford, Pontiac third, and Dodge fourth. And then here's lap champ, and I move up to second. Yay. Ah, thank you so much for watching this screwed episode of NASCAR Thunder 2003. I'm Jack Ross from NASCAR MK. Okay, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more, but uh, until next time, we will see you from Wine Country at Infineon Raceway.